Welcome back to another external share quick tutorial. This topic will be how to add comments to your share pages in Confluence. The benefits of using this feature, you're able to add real time comments internally when collaborating with other team members, or in most cases with users outside of your instance, such as contractors, sales or stakeholders. Let's get started by creating a new external link. Once the page is loaded, feel free to create a new link name. I'm going to change this one to sharing is caring. From here, I'm going to share this page without turning on the comment feature. This will be an example of what the page would look like. So from here, you would click save. You would click on the external link that you just created. And as you notice, you're not able to add any comments down below. You can then exit back the page. Then we're going to click on our external edit link. Then we're going to go down to our permission options and add comments. From there, you would then click save. Go back to the existing link that you've just created. And now you can see the comment options are now turned on. And let's go ahead and We would then click save. And now your comment section is now added along with your comment and your information. Now you may say to yourself, well, adding comments are great, but I would love the option to be able to add inline comments. Well, now you can. Let's go back to our page and we are looking to share and add inline comments too. Now you must remember that you're only allowed to add inline comments to existing ones. So let me show you what I mean. So from here, you would then click exit. This is going to be the page that we add the inline comment to. So you would then hit your edit marker. And we're just going to highlight this whole thing and we're going to turn on comments. And we're going to say, please type your your answers down below. Then click save. Notice how you're able to write a comment under the, the, the section here, but we're gonna just go ahead and publish this. We're gonna click back on our external share link that we just created. We're going to click on the inline comment. And now we can just type in our information and say, Notice how you were able to now see the inline comment. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to turn off the comment section. then click save, then return back to our existing external link that we've created. And when we go to click on the inline comment, now you're not able to add any more comments to the existing one. Thanks again for joining us for this quick tutorial on how to add comments to shared pages.